Yo, what is up my fellow animals? Welcome back to another tier list and today guys we continue our series of each region of Pokemon that we would eat. Today the tier list goes as divine, delicious, tasty, okay, man, lethal, and in inedible and today we are ranking the Kalos Pokemon and how I think they would taste, where I would put them, um, because we know we're going to eat some Pokemon today. So to start off, we're going to go with... We got Chespin. Chespin is probably uh, okay. Quilladin, probably delicious. Look how plump that boy is. Um, a little more tough. Or I said Chespin's tasty. My bad. Um, I would say Chestnut's a little more a little more tough. Roasted Fox, probably pretty good, honestly. I've never had Fox, but I have to guess. Um, Brakeson just got more meat. And then uh, Del Fox is... I think it's, it, it's probably okay. It's a little humanoid. Frog legs, though, we're talking delicious. I love frog legs. So all the Greninjas are all of Froakie's line and the Greninjas are all going in delicious, I think. Maybe we'll put okay to Frogadier and, 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 and uh, or tasty, not okay, man. For Froakie and um, Frogadier just because there's not as much meat on the bones. Diggersby and Bunnelby probably pretty grainy. I mean, it's rabbit. Rabbit's good. Uh, I mean, he's a plump boy. You just got to clean it well, I think, is the problem there. Then we're going to go with, we have the roasted bird. This is one chicken wing, and I love chicken wings. Delicious. But this is a plump Thanksgiving dinner. That's divine. I love Thanksgiving dinner more than anything. Bugs are probably meh. I mean, crunchy bug. I'm not I'm not putting all the Vivian um, uh, forms in here. They're not going to taste any different. They might, but probably not. Uh, so I'm putting them in meh. They're bugs. Bugs aren't that, you know, tasty. Litleo, cat, lion. Probably pretty gamey. I'm probably going to say okay. Same with Pyroar. And then there's the other form, but it doesn't really matter what form it is per se. But I do think they'd be okay. I don't think they'd be terrible, but I probably wouldn't need a second time. Flabebe, here's the thing. I bet you can make a tasty tea out of Flabebe along with Floet and um, and Florges. So we're all going to put them all in, in tasty. I cause Not because, I mean, it's leaves for the most part, but you can make a tea. And I think you can make a pretty darn good tea. Um, and then you could also have also do immortal immortal tea. Maybe never know. I would love immortal tea delicious That'd be cool as all get out Then we go to skidoo. Uh, we got a leafy meaty boy. Is it vegan? Is it beyond meat? Is it beyond beef or beyond goat? Uh, if it is it's probably meh. That's not you know mimicking real meat I, I wouldn't say is a is a substitution for real meat dude. That's all I'm saying Kung Fu Panda, Pancham, and Pangoro. Ah, oh, man. I'm going to put OK, and then Pangoro is probably pretty fatty, so I'm going to put them both in OK. Something tells me that maybe the meat's a little rancid, but if you find the right Pangoro or Pancham, you'll be fine. Furfro! We'll put Furfro, the dog. I'm not eating dogs, but some places do, so I'm putting it in OK. It probably wouldn't be bad, but not probably not my cup of tea. Esper and uh, Meow Stick. Esper's seen some stuff, guys, and he's probably seen other people eat his family. I bet that trauma is not good for your muscle, your muscles, and your fat, your, your you know, your tissue, the edible parts. I bet it's not good for him. So, and Meowstic got revenge, but also, it's probably a little bit better than Esper, honestly. I don't, I don't know why, but something, looking look at that, just tells me a little better than Esper. Then we go the old swords. They're just ghost swords can't really eat a sword dude some people do and they don't actually swallow swords they just like stick it down their throat but and then they pull it back out and they're okay but you know they're they're just metal and you can't really digest metal uh spritzy is something you know it's probably lethal this is hear me out it's a plague doctor it's got the plague on it spritzy and aroma teas are lethal do not eat the plague tell you that right now now I'm a sweets guy, but cotton candy's not my go-to, but to not put these guys in delicious is anything but, you know, asinine. So, you know, um, Slurpuff and, uh, um, why can't I think of both of their names? Swirlix and Swirlpuff, they're going up there. NK, Malamar, probably meh. Probably not the best. I mean, squid's good. Squid's good, but it's, it's, it's dark squid. So I don't know. I'm gonna say okay for Malamar. Actually, NK's probably better, and Malamar's probably meh close to lethal if i had to guess if i had to guess that's what i'm saying these guys are just, God, you probably could eat these but it'd just be like 
rock soup you know what i mean you just salt season the rocks and put it in soup and people just kind of kind of just you know suck the seasoning off of so the 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 rocks so then we got scrap poisonous is it lethal he's water right he's water dragon so i'm i'm gonna say meh he probably doesn't taste pretty good probably because he leaves in a polluted area and then dragalge is um lethal because of his poisonous uh ability but now we got the the lobsters or crawdads or whatever they are and dude i love selfish selfish is selfish it's not selfish self wow shellfish divine meaty meaty claws on them i'm putting them in divine helius i bet these are pretty tasty i bet helius and helioptile or however you say it lizards you know electric like a pop rock lizard meat i bet it'd be okay um rocky dirty dirty dinosaur i really don't know what a dinosaur would taste like would it taste like birds or would it taste like lizards if it tastes like birds i'm putting it in tasty if it tastes like lizards it would go down to okay but i'm i'm banking on bird big birds frozen stays fresh well that doesn't make sense uh stays edible longer so and you know they're all going in tasty honestly all the all the fossils cat fox thing it's not roasted it's not i mean i would have probably meh I don't know maybe okay i'll put it in okay i'd put sylveon in okay i mean it's probably not a lot of meat it's just a little cat thing you probably get like one good meal out of it though i would say it's okay halucha bird birds are tasty chicken wings fighting chicken wings probably a little tough but still could get over that uh little mouse guy probably meh i don't know what a mouse would taste like but i can't imagine it tastes tasting good carbink not lethal same thing kind of goes with uh binacle or barrel well, what is it? God, I can't remember these guys' names. Be Barbarical? Carbink would be there. Salt rock soup thing. That's what it's got going for it. Uh, Gumi. Something tells me the, the drip that it has, that side is just lethal. Don't eat your car keys. Clef keys going in inedible. Uh, Phantump. Can't really eat ghost, but you could probably eat the bark. But it probably wouldn't taste great. So it's going in meh. Not lethal, but it might be. Maybe it's cursed and that's what causes lethality. But the word itself would not kill you right away. Pumpkin boo. Pumpkin. Let's make some lethal pumpkin pie. I would say okay. Is it worth the risk? Probably not. But we're going to try it. So pumpkin boo and gore guys, they're getting okay. We could make some okay pumpkin pie with them. Um, Berg Mike. Now, here's the thing. Do you define ice as tasty? No, but I would say it's refreshing. So Bergmite and Avalug are going in tasty, but only because they would be so refreshing. They're just big ice cubes. Noibat, I don't know. Bats are probably gross. Not lethal, so I'm going to put it in meh. Probably should be a gross or you know disgusting category, but Noibat and Noivern, I couldn't imagine a wyvern tasting good. Maybe it does. Maybe it tastes like an alligator or something, but who knows? Not me. And then the deer, dude, venison. Delicious. Delicious. Death bird. I guarantee you, you eat a Yavaltal, you're dying. That's it's only logical reason. Only logical reasoning. Zygarde, dude, probably, man, but really it should be gross because they're made up of these gooey cells and these gooey cells just look like boogers. So all the forms of Zygarde, boogers, 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 meh gross actually then we go dancy we'll just put the normal one same situation as carbink it may be maybe a little sweeter just because it's more refined maybe i don't know what i mean it's it, it definitely is just it's meh it's meh not gross but it'd be meh and then we got hoopa hoopa's like a spirit kind of thing i don't think you can really eat a hoopa Volcanion's not metal but dang it does it look metal and it's i mean it's boiling water so I'm gonna say it's lethal honestly like if you couldn't drink boiling water you would die like your insides would burn so it has to be lethal i mean that the, yeah so that's my reasoning for it if you take if it's just the animal itself and none of its capabilities probably meh i i don't know it it's just it, it has a lot of metal looking parts a lot of metal looking parts and it almost i almost want to put it in an edible but if you're drinking you know if it's got water in it you're burning to death that's just how it is so that is my tier like it's a short a short little tier list um mainly because Kalos doesn't have a lot of pokemon 
in the future we'll do a mega one too as well uh but for now well this is my tier list for kalos let me know what you guys think um what pokemon from kalos would you eat what pokemon do you think are the tastiest obviously which ones do you think could, you know would end you that i may not have in the right spot so that's all i have for today and until next time guys peace